Hi guys, welcome to the channel. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about the Linux commands for uh, to learning Hadoop. Please uh, like and subscribe my channel. First command uh, is a date. If you want to check the date, uh, you can use the com uh, the command called date. It will show you the what is the date uh, uh, date with the type. Okay. So if you want to see the calendar, uh, the cal is a uh, command which will uh, use to uh, see the calendar it will show at the calendar okay and the next command would be uh, mkdir like uh, so if you want to check the in which directory you are present you can use the present working directory this is a pwd so this means the present working directory so now i am in the home my shining um, directory so uh, if you want to to check in which directory you are you can use the pwd okay the next command i am going to show you is like mkdir mkdir is used to uh, uh, create the directory so uh, if you want to create a directory and you want to store any files you should create a directory uh, a specific directory for your files so i am creating a directory example so if you want to see whether the directory is created or not or uh, what are the files uh, on directories present in that uh, this present working directory you can use ll so ll command will show you all the directories and the files uh, which is present in that particular directory so if you see here uh, if you uh, observe here there is a directories and file H how we can uh, find which are all the directories and which are all the files you have to observe uh, here uh, if you see these two these two are the directories because it is started with the d and if you see this one it is started with the hyphen hyphen in the sense that means it is the file okay again this one is a directory which is created by we now okay uh, so uh, example directory we are created if you want to go inside that example directory you have to use cd cd is for the change directory okay so uh, if you want to go inside the directory you have to use uh, a cd so again if you want to check the files ll or ls ls, LS also it will show you the uh, uh, files okay let me go one side one step back it is if you want to go previous uh, directory you have to use uh, cd dot dot so it will take you in the previous directory if you see if you use the ls it will show only the names of the uh, files or directories but you can't uh, differentiate what are the files and what are the uh, directories okay for that you should use the ll okay so uh, now you know what is the how to list the uh, files how to differentiate between the directories and the files and uh, if you want to create the uh, files okay now you created the directory if you want to create the files you can use there is a touch is on command uh, you can use touch it will create an empty file if you see this is the size of the uh, file okay if you see the size of the file would be the empty like uh, zero size zero byte size okay so i'll discuss about uh, what are these uh, uh, what are what this all okay as of now this is the size okay this uh, column is represents the size of the file okay so touch will create the empty uh, a file okay if you want to view the data inside the file you can use the cat you see there is no data presence inside this it, touch will create only the empty uh, file if you want to create uh, insert data into the file you can use cat even so this is a cat greater than symbol and uh, if you want to insert the data you can insert the data like this okay so if you want to come out of the editor mode you can use the control c so now let's see uh, view the data okay. to view the data again we are going to use a cat see now the data will be there by using cat we inserted the data so this is a, a way to insert the data okay so if you want if you want to append the data here now you inserted uh, 
but if you again use this uh, greater than symbol it will rewrite the like it will overwrite entire data let's try let's try that one if you want to append the data let's try to append this way only for example i have to append the uh, one line so uh, if you see now it is overwritten the data so if you want to append the data then you have to use a um, double greater than symbol so for example now uh, i have to append this data to existing file i can use greater than symbol okay so now you know how how to use the cat here okay to create to view the uh, file and uh, to insert the data and to append the data okay so let's go to the other uh, ways of creating the file now you know the touch and cat and if you uh, there is another way of nano nano is a way you can uh, uh, create the file by using nano so nano is the editor mode it will go to the editor mode uh, simple i have to create this file control x create the content uh, give control x if you want to save this one it will give you the uh, pop up here whether you want to save this uh, buffer or not you want to save click s yes. otherwise n once you given an uh, y okay, if you want to save this y then you have to give enter okay now if you see if you want to view the data again view by using cat it will print the data okay so if you want to uh, once you edited the data something if you don't want to save this one again control x here you have to give n okay then it won't save the data if you use n it won't save any data there okay and there is another one also we can create by using vi okay uh, let's see by creating the vi so vi is a uh, editor mode uh, here uh, vi is a another editor okay here there is uh, in real time most of the people are using vi because in vi we have a number of options okay you can search the data we can search and replace the data okay you can search for the string like okay so here if you want to insert the data here you can't insert by default okay if you click anything it won't insert any data by default it not in the edited mode so you have to go to if you want to go to the edited mode you have to give escape i if you give the escape i it will go to the edited mode okay if you again go back to the uh, uh, non escape mode or uh, non uh, in, uh, insert mode you have to click on ins uh, escape if you give the uh, uh, es escape again okay it will go back to the uh, previous state only okay so in, uh, once you uh, added the data here you modify the data then you have to give escape colon okay uh, escape colon wq wq in the sentence write and quit okay let's see now uh, uh, the data which is present inside that abc.txt we created this abc.txt by using the vi command okay so let's see now uh, if you want to if you edited the data and if you don't want to ins uh, like write the data for example now i added this line and i don't want to uh, add uh, i change my mind and uh, i don't want to save now then you have to give escape colon and q exclamation mark this means you don't need to write anything just with the uh, this mode okay let's see now again abc dot Text. See, only the one line will be there because we not saved the data. So this is all about the editors and um, creating the files. Okay, uh, let's see now. You want.